Hey, you want to open the door? We don't need to. You can step. Open the door. You can step up. Open the door. Are you the supervisor? I am not going to step up. Truck drivers. Hear me. Can I have your attention? <laughs> What's good, everybody, and welcome back. Yes, sir. Back again with another one. With another one. Welcome back to the Lockout Man Podcast Show, the coolest podcast on the tube right now. And we're here with another Trucker's Reaction video. And in today's video, we're going to be reacting to this guy right here. Man, I, I just don't know what to say about these these cops that don't know how to drive a semi, but it's good to tell you how to drive a semi. Here's a young man being trained. His trainer looks like it's the one with the camera. Unfortunately, this cop is being somewhat, you know, bullish or whatever the case you guys want to call him. Pulls him over. And says, bro, you going down you you going down to six percent grade at fifteen miles per hour. You're what do you say? You're impeding traffic. You got cars swerving around you, and you're impeding traffic that might cause an accident. Really? Going down to six percent grade at fifteen miles per hour? Is that a hindrance? I don't know. Hey, you want to open the door? We don't need to. You can step. Open the door. You can step up. Open the door. Are you the supervisor? I am not going to step up. I'm going to open the door. Nah, we're not opening the door, bro. We're not doing that. Not with that attitude, we're not. I feel uncomfortable opening the door. And why should we open the door, bro? You could have just stepped your butt up on the stair and 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 talked to us through the window, dude. You're talking about open the door in the days of COVID and everything. You over here talking about open the door. No, we're not doing that, my G. We're not opening the door today. Not with you. You really got a man in the red box. Where's my license? right there. I'll give it to you in a second. What's this for? It's for impeding traffic. Is it a ticket? Well, yes. we're going down it again, by the way. I'm sorry? And I'm on the phone with my company. We're going down yeah. it again, by the way. Go ahead. Yeah. I'm curious how, as part of my training, I have to uh, I understand that. It's, it's look, very unfortunate that your company makes you guys do this. Will you let what me What they're making you do is unsafe. Really? Really, my G? How is that unsafe we we going down a hill we going down a grade that's at about six percent and he's a trainee so he's going to need to know what to do in certain situations especially again if he got 40 pounds in the box 40 pounds in the box bro Trying to keep that truck under under control, going down a grade with 40 pounds in the box. It's kind of hard to do, my G. Really? Can I finish? What's unsafe is somebody not getting trained to know how to go down a mountain. I have, okay. I have to know how to go down a mountain without a jake break. And, and, without and, a and jake. you don't have to do that for 20 miles. I'm not We're not doing it for 20 miles. Though. We started yeah. going down it at okay. 157. That, that, okay. That's what I'm saying. I, I'm okay. not, and we've gone down to six miles so box. far. I, I understand this guy's training you. I would recommend that you do whatever he says the opposite. I mean, wow. So my G, let me ask you a question, my G. Are you a truck driver? Are you a trainer? How did you do? You are state trooper, DOT, or where the fuck you is for the moment right now, bro. You damn sure don't know nothing about no trucks, yo. This man is trying to teach this man how to go down a mountain without Jake brakes. And you over here telling this man, oh, well, everything, everything he tells you to do, I need you to do the opposite. Really? Really? <laughs> Well, I, I need clarification on this. Okay, so, 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 how how is the safe way to go down a mountain in, 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 in training? It, hey, it hang, on, not, hang on, I'm not done with you. In training. I'm done with you. In training. I need to see how are they supposed to be able to? I understand that. 
read, read the whole thing. Oh, when your signature in the red box is for impeding traffic. I don't owe you an explanation, okay? If you want an explanation, you can come to court. How, how are you supposed to go down a mountain in snow? Down, I want an explanation. Bro, you owe this man an explanation. You 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 writing him a ticket. I, I I can't ask you what the what what the explanation of the ticket for. You want me to sign off on this ticket? I'm not signing off on nothing if I don't understand it. I don't understand why you giving me a ticket for what? You said it's impeding traffic. Explain to me how am I impeding traffic going down a sixth grade mountain? Explain that to me. Well, forty pounds. 40 well i keep what i keep saying 40 pounds Forty thousand pounds in the box help me out here help me understand that because i'm not signing no ticket where's my license give me my license there's a pen at the oh no there isn't oh my license is right here i would like an explanation i don't know you one i've just given you right. one it is not safe to that. drive down this hill at 15 miles an hour for no reason. It's not You've got traffic backing up. It is behind. for reasons. There is no reason. Where's your super get your supervisor out here? I'm not I have already you. requested your supervisor. You have to get your supervisor I don't out have here. To do yes, you do. You. I'm recording you too. I, I don't care if you're recording me. I'm recording too. I got all sorts of cameras. Well then get your supervisor. I, I've already demanded your supervisor. Oh, you've demanded it? Yeah. Wow. Hello. Uh, uh, I need your signature in the red box. Supervisor. I'm not in the I want your I want your supervisor. Really? I've been behind you for a mile? Yes. I want a supervisor. What, what, what is the problem with that, bro? I mean, my man asked for a supervisor so he could get a better understanding of why you pulled him over for going down a six point grade, six percent grade at about 15 to 20 miles an hour by being trained by the trainer of how to drive the uh, uh, how to drive the truck do you bro know how to drive a truck man are you a certified trainer where is your credentials at bro i put my camera on you've got a ton of traffic Swerving to go around you, it is not safe. I'm on a six percent grade. It is not safe. I am being It safe. is safe. Okay, really? Because the trainer that I stopped in Stevens Trucking yesterday agreed with me that it's not safe. Oh, okay. So that's 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 where we got it from. That's that's who we got it from. That's where we that's where we got our five minute tr uh, truck course from. A trainer with Stevens Transport that you stopped yesterday. 24 hours ago so that trainer yesterday said well going down to six percent grade at 15 miles per hour is unsafe is truck drivers i need to know i need to know is going down a six percent grade seven eight or whatever the case grade may be is unsafe at maybe 15 20 25 miles per hour with 40,000 pounds in the box. It is he wishes safe. that he couldn't do it. I haven't had an accident, nor a ticket, oh. or a violation in seven years. Get your supervisor. Get your supervisor. I've if asked there's one working. I will sit here and wait for okay. the supervisor. I need to see and I'm still the recording you. Or you're going to jail. He needs to read it, and he's got time to read it. Okay? And, and I'm trying to still go in the red box. about this. The signature is not an admission of guilt. It's just a promise to take care of it in court. So if it's not an admission of guilt or anything like that, then why are you threatening him with incarceration? So if he don't sign the ticket, he's going to jail. Why? You just said that it's not an admission of guilt. So if it's not an admission of guilt, then I don't have to sign the ticket. Oh, it just says that you're going to show up in court. Well, I got the ticket. You're going to put it in the computer, showing that you gave the ticket. Now I know I got the ticket and I got to show up in court. Why do I got to sign it? And if I don't sign it, I'm going to jail. You're going to take me to jail because I I, I haven't signed the ticket. What's 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 the what's what's the gist on that? What is the gist? Why are you threatening me with incarceration if I don't 
sign the ticket. And you still haven't even brought your supervisor over. All this time, you could be on the you could be on the horn right now and be like, yo, uh, I need a supervisor to come to such and such and such and such. You're not admitting guilt by signing the ticket. He needed to finish reading the whole thing first. And he needs to explain for thoroughly why you're getting it. And you want to get your supervisor yet? Uh, no, I don't. You're, you're still refusing to get your supervisor? I am. Well, then we're not signing until you get your supervisor. He's going to sign it or he's going to jail. I think he can make up in his, his, his own mind. Well, he can make up his own mind. You're right. Yeah. And, and so do you I still want to go to jail or do you want to sign the ticket? By federal law, you have to. Yeah. You have to. I mean, there is no federal Yes, there is a federal law. law. Oh if I God. request your supervisor, your supervisor Just like there's a federal here. law, I can't open your door? I didn't say there was a federal law. It's, I still have rights to privacy. I would like to. Even in a commercial vehicle, I have a right to privacy. To now, I, I don't know about federal laws and all this other stuff and all like that, but I know for a fact if I didn't want to open up my door, I didn't have to open up my door, bro. You could have stepped up on a you could have stepped up on a step, talked to me through the window. I feel my I, I, I feel uncomfortable with you right now with my door open. COVID <laughs> COVID anybody? COVID in the ticket. Don't listen to this guy. No, well, I'm the one getting the ticket. And your signature on the ticket is not an admission of guilt. Just needs you. Actually, it is. No, yes, it is. Read the box. Yes. It says by signing, by signing, I do not. Admit Without guilt. admitting guilt, I promise to appear in court. Exactly. Okay. You go. I'll tell you what. Call your supervisor. My supervisor is about an hour away. If you want to really? sit here for an hour, an hour. It's this not is a one big of area. the DOT station. This is a, no. That's a different office. Well, I guess we got an hour to kill. No, that's fine. You want to wait that long? You wait that long. Okay. I still you need still to call them in the red box. I will get them. I will see how long they are. Well, I'll tell you that. I'll, I'll sign the ticket Bring for it. you when you get your supervisor hey, on the You will sign the Unlock, ticket now. Can you unlock that you again? I've asked for your supervisor, and you haven't even attempted to call your supervisor. I'll tell you what, I'll attempt here. I'll see if they're around. Appreciate it. Here yeah, what you're talking about. Don't listen to that guy. <laughs> wow. Don't listen to your trainer. So I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to listen to you. Uh, 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 a guy that just got information of uh, 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 a 10 minute crack course from from a Stevens transport trainer <laughs> oh, man and it takes you this long to call your supervisor then bro you know you're in the wrong you're in the wrong because when your supervisor gets there I'm sure your supervisor is probably going to side with the truck driver. I believe that he will side with the truck driver in this situation right here. Hey, Scott, this is Charles. Uh, any sergeants still around? Is Brad still around? Sign in the red box. I'll still get someone out here, but I need your signature. Hey, Brad, Charles. Talk to you, man. Hey, I'm I'm on a stop here, uh, westbound, west of Room, and someone would like to speak to a supervisor. Then that's up to you. Then go ahead and sign it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but if you don't want to go, oh, uh, it's a it's a trucker I stopped, and uh, he doesn't want to sign the ticket. So there you have it, guys. There you have it. What do you guys think? Who was who was in the right? Was was the trainer in the right, or was the 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 officer in the right? Let me know. Let let me know what you think in the comments below, man. This this is this is crazy. This is crazy. I mean, I went down I I went down mountains, and I I did maybe about twenty twenty five with the Jake brakes on, and I was in the right lane blinkers on and everything if you're going slow it says uh if you're going slower than 45 miles an hour put your blinkers on right right 
I've seen trucks that's on like 3% grades that's doing 15 damn near crawling uh crawling down the hill. I'm just I'm just saying, maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. Let let me know, guys. Let me know what your thoughts in the comments below. Yo, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you very much. I appreciate the support. If you guys want to support the channel, you can do that. If you guys want to support the channel, you can do that. All the donation apps is in the description below. Cash app, PayPal, the coffee app. Hook your brother up with some coffee. If you like this video right here, make sure you leave a like. It works. It helps. It does the channel good. If you guys like what I do over here, you know what I'm saying? The coolest podcast on the tube right now. And plus, let me just throw this out there. The best conversations starts over here at the live out me in podcast show make sure you catch all of the interviews that i be doing with all these interesting truck drivers out here yo make sure to hit that subscribe button and that bell notification so you can get notified when i drop content on the daily until next time everybody i am your host thank you very much shout out to you shannon i'm looking at you shannon all right, you take it easy, and I'll come back at you with another one. Peace.